Well, we do have some new information as we continue to dig into talks about the future of the Orchard Mesa pool. Now, we told you how Mayor Anna Stout announced the pool would remain open until a new rec center is built in Matchett Park. Funding for that center is supposed to be on the April ballot. The pool's future seemed unclear after School District 51 bowed out of the three-way deal between the city and the county to maintain and operate it. After all, estimates are that the pool needs more than $2 million in repairs. And although supporters welcome the announcement, we're still fielding questions from you about how officials reached that tentative deal. Our reporter Christian Seed is working for you to find some of those answers. Christian, what did you find out for us today? Adam, we already told you how our, our records request for city council and district emails from November and late December indicated the three favored closing the pool, but now the controversy had some calling for increased transparency. A city spokesperson told us in an email the council made this decision to have Anna Stout serve as a negotiator on November 2nd in executive session, but Sims, Councilman Simpson and others questioned when Stout started acting as negotiator. Here's why. A letter from Stout to the school district shows talks began on October 31st. That's prior to that November executive session. Simpson says the decision for Stout to represent the city should have been made in public. Uh, I would like to explain what actually happened on no November 2nd. Anna attended the meet, brought to us in executive session a proposal that she had negotiated before November 2nd and asked us for commenting back to her about what we thought of a proposal that she had already negotiated. And that's where the latest update ended after Simpson and others voted down Stout's push to talk about the pool behind closed doors in executive session. I emailed Mayor Anna Stout to make sure she got her take. She indicated she wasn't available for an interview today. We'll follow up again next week. Christian Sita, 11 News. All right, Christian, thank you so much for that report.